Hi, I'm Melissa from Northline Express, here to tell you about an important accessory to go with your Skeeter Back Mosquito Trap, and that's the Skeeter Back Tack Traps. These are the sticky paper that goes around the top of your unit and collects all those mosquitoes that get close to the unit, but they might not get sucked up by the vacuum. This is a very simple product to use. When you get it out of the box, you're going to get two, and they'll be rolled up just like this one is here. You're going to unroll it, and then the white side of the paper will go towards the unit, You'll wrap it around, and I recommend doing this with the brown protective layer still on because it's less hassle and you don't have to worry about it sticking to yourself or your clothes. Stick the tab into the slot and then remove the brown protective paper and it's ready to go. I can't, however, tell you approximately how often you're going to need to change it because that can vary due to the varying mosquito populations depending on your area. However, when your tack trap is about 80 to 90% full, we recommend that you change it out at that time. A couple tips about your Skeeter Vac Tack Trap. They are very sticky. They're designed to be in order to be effective. So make sure that you're keeping small children as well as pets away from the tack traps to avoid anyone or any pets getting stuck to the unit. For those of you who may have butterfly gardens in your backyard or you enjoy feeding the birds, they will become attracted to this unit. And we recommend creating a mesh protective barrier to go over your entire Skeeter Vac that has large enough slots for mosquitoes and other biting pest insects to get through, but it's got small enough holes to keep those out. That'll pre prevent any birds or butterflies from becoming stuck to your Skeeter Vac trap. I hope that these tips have been helpful for you today. And remember to stock up on your tack traps and bait blocks so you can keep your backyard mosquito free all season long.